Oh, snap. It's indestructible! Oh. Hello everyone, we're back for another custom story because uh, Baldo's discovery is like crashing or something. Like, every time I try to leave that general area, because there's nothing there, as far as I can see, there's no nowhere else to go. So we're trying to go back for the door, and it lets me go back for the door. It doesn't say, like, you can't go this way or something. But the problem is, it crashes. And then, you know, Baldur's Discovery has stopped responding or some shit like that. So we're going to be playing a new custom story. And it's La Casa, or La Casa. I don't know how you say it. So let's, let's see what it says. A scientist receives a letter from a colleague, but their plans are adverted when the plane's engines fail. What the hell can... Because the story is this. Is it got a plane? Am I on a plane? Stranded now, a protagonist in the wilds of the jungle. Will you survive? I'm in a jungle. Oh snap. Jung jungle animals. How does it got art artwork? Writing of a sight. You probably can't see this. Fucking fraps. Uh, it's gone now anyway. Beware when standing in. Oh, shut up. I love that already. This doesn't look like a forest. Is that a tree? This is a strange tree. Ah, letter. The newspaper is brown and worn. Perhaps someone has wiped their ass with it. <sighs> Cure all? At all possible? What? Today, two scientists, Albert Jones and Eugene Crowley, are researching a new pharmaceutical that will treat all ailments. From the common cold to kakikonic tissue, the two have been nominated for Nobel's Peace Prize, and she wins. If their research is conclusive, the jar of dirt. Anyone know the reference for the jar of dirt? Jar of dirt. No? Post it in the comments if you know. There's a bunny rabbit. Post it in the comments if you know where the jar of dirt reference is. Bunny rabbit. Web web bunny. Sit down, bro. The frame rate is a bit dodgy. What you doing? Frame rate. His letter. Eugene, I hope this letter finds you well, as I have exciting news I must share with you. Last night, while I was kicking my feet up at the pub, I was approached by a well-dressed man. His hair was greased back, and his suit was quite snazzy. He was obviously there for business. Serious business. He told me that he knew me from the research you and I had begun, but never finished during our time at the university. He then went into great detail, explaining how he stumbled upon it while attending college, and found that we were onto something. Our research for a cure-all medication was closer to completion than we could ever have expected. He then went on to explain that we are only missing one chemical in our experiment. He called it Scientite, as he produced a small vial of purple liquid from his coat. He informed me that the small vial of liquid was retrieved from a research team in South Africa. The team has found the source of Scientite and said it can be extracted in great quantities, but they need more scientists to aid in their studies. So that is where you come in, my friend. Travel to Africa with me, and we will be remembered as the ones who saved humanity from all illness, all disorders. Signed, Albert Jones. Problem with that, dude. Is it, what the hell happened then? Is that the world would overpopulate. I've been watching Torchwood. And then season four. Spoiler alert! There you go. Oh, shit! I can throw this at someone and kill it. Hold on, buddy. What? Oh, is he deaf? The bunny already dead, though. What? Is he already dead? Ah! Oh. No! That doesn't help. Okay. Time to leave this place. This is the exit. Is that the jungle? Is that the plane? That's the plane crashing in the jungle. My ears are ringing. <laughs> what happened? Oh, too many 
cigarettes. <coughs> this, is, this is more far. <coughs> yeah. Yeah. I hope he doesn't mind me saying that. <laughs> ah, it's trolling him. Because he smokes. And this guy's coughing. In case you didn't get the joke, people. Oh, he opened it. It goes that way. I was going sideways. Lantern. In the bar. I'm at... Hold on, where did I come from? What the hell? I came from here. There was a door. Or was that just my dream world? Okay. So we're in a forest with lots of badly textured trees. The Indiana Jones? What the hell? It is a tiger. It's what the hell? Seriously? That was a crappy loading screen. I ran for what felt like my... <sighs> okay. Okay. This way. I picked up the oil. I picked it. What the hell was that? It was like an owl. Woo! Woo! Who there? Who the who do? Who did it? Ha <laughs> ha! Shh! Wind. The tense feeling of being watched was something I couldn't shake. Ah. Pro tip, if you feel like you're being watched, you probably are. On Facebook. <laughs> the door's rusted and won't budge. I have no objects. To defeat it. Key. Bar barrel has a key. Has a note. The barrel won't move. What the hell, can of candle? The size of that. Ladies, what do you rank that? <laughs> Research entry 34. Dr. G. Griezmann. It's been a week since we arrived at the site. Our contractor, a Mr. Blue, seems to have forgotten to mention that this research outpost, and the source of this scientite, was being held in the confines of this forgotten temple. The other doctors have made reports of unusual noises coming from the depths. I assured him it was nothing but the wind. I, too, heard these sounds, though. This place gives me the creeps. I just want to finish gathering this chemical and leave as soon as possible. I second that, Broseph. Or is that actually me? I oh, want maybe it's me. Anyway. Who am I? Pits! No! Dude, this is in the inside. Where's the tigers? And the lions? Ugh. I'm about to vomit. He opened the door. You opened it for me. Thank you, Broseph. Hey, you meant to hold it for me. You know, it's polite. Back entrance. <laughs> Ugh. Monster, you came in here. <laughs> oh, God damn it! Who did it? Oh, that was. I almost died. The bricks landed on my head. My head is made of bone. So it is indestructible. Picked up a crowbar. Research entry 88. Dr. G. Friesman. The team was right. The sounds were a warning and we did not heed it. We had just set up after reaching a rich source of scientite when Birmingham, our botanist, went missing. We called for her on the radio but got nothing back. Soon enough, Lewis, our geologist, went missing during the search for Birmingham. Leaving us with only myself, Dr. Kleiner, and Dr. Wang. We came back to the main chamber of this place after much discussion. We decided to board the main hall, wait three days for the missing team members to make their way back to camp, and if they do not show, we will return to Mr. Blue to form a proper search party. So we say party. Party! Ow! Ow! Put the boxes in the hole. In the hole. Then that water goes down. Huh. Listen. Does it go through the entire earth? 
That's what it seems like. I do not want to jump. We need to find a Broseph. And we need to like lure him down there. Broseph! There's a hole. You need to like ch check the hole. Broseph. Crowbar it. I'll break it. Break it! I broke. I broke it. Crowbar? Crowbar? Crowbar! It sacrificed its life so that I could break some wood. I can hide under the stairs if the monster comes. Monster! Loading screen. These halls were visited before myself. That was comforting. The conclusion of the past visitors unsettling, though. Happened here. These are my mice. The dead did. Is that one? It's like a dog. It's on its back. It's like legs up here. Who did it? Who killed the mice? Rats are actually intelligent. Like Link isn't a rat. I didn't get a rat because the tails are icky. Uh, like Link's tail is like it's like a little bump. It's got loads of fur on it, so it's it's nice tail. I can touch it. I can pick him up, and it doesn't freak me out. But the thing is, he's dumb, and that's me being kind. <laughs> he he's not very smart, but you know, rats are smart, more intelligent creatures than hamsters. Uh, do I regret it? I don't know. Doubt it. Not really. It's still fun. Just, just stupid. Like me. Oh, the blood. All this blood cannot come from these rats. It's absurd. Okay, which way? This way? Tits! <laughs> Push! Hello? You bang the door. Knock, knock! Who there? Ugh. Who there? What in the hell? Don't fall! That is, that is fucked up. <clears throat> the water works. Oh shit. Does that mean there's water on the floor? Oh, drain. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm so thankful for you, Drain. You have no idea. Or if there was water on the ground, I would run the opposite way. You would no! Damn it, water! It's trolling me. I heard what I said, and they put water on. The walls here look weak in me. Oh, shit! Okay, okay. That's an indication not to go that way. What the hell? 